I really can't believe this school year is over. It seemed like just yesterday we were celebrating a new school year with our back to school cookout and welcoming another group of seventh and eighth graders to Archbishop Williams. We have laughed in classes, some more than others. Many made principal's list and enjoyed pizza with Dr. V each term. You had rewarding days of service where you helped those in your communities. You played on sports teams that played for championships or teams for sports you had never played before. Some joined the theater production for the first time. Others were inducted into the National Junior Honor Society, and some were, were responsible for helping out on shadow days, showing prospective students what it means to be a bishop for the day. This year's eighth grade class has so many talented and amazing students. I cannot wait to see what you will do next year and beyond. It won't be long before you are walking across the stage in the auditorium and receiving your diplomas. But on your way to senior year, don't lose sight of what makes you, you. If this year has taught us anything, is that you cannot always predict what the future holds. Life has certainly thrown us all a curveball this spring, but you have all persevered and worked hard to make the best of the situation. And we are all so proud and impressed by you. It would have been far easier to give in and throw in the towel and to stop going to virtual classes. But day after day, you showed up and you showed just how determined and hardworking you all are. I don't know what plans God ultimately has for you, but what I do know is whatever it is, God will use you to extend mercy, compassion, and justice for others. You will be someone who can be trusted to do what is right, even if it is difficult. As you enter high school, I pray you will continue to make the right choices and friends, maintaining close friendships with people who will help to draw you closer to God and who will build you up and cheer you on as you do great and amazing things. I hope you know what a truly unique, talented, and amazing group of people you are. I hope you all have a safe and wonderful summer, and I look forward to seeing what you all do in the future. The following grade eight students have successfully completed their middle school career and begin their journey into grade nine and beyond. Abby Bemis, Jack Brady, Owen Callahan, Nadia Casamajor, Sasha Casamajor, Grania Conlon, Jack Constantine, Will Cuniff, Julian Curtis, Aiden Dolan, Ben Fennelly, Jack Finn, Tommy Flaherty, Sam Hall, Brody Hessian, Millie Hines, Alana Kearney, Jack Keneally, Don Lee, Bobby Lydon, Chloe McCauley, Tommy McDonough, Taryn McGuire, Rory Mulkern, Scarlett Mulkern, Nate Murray, Natalie Nguyen, Luca Nataro, Evan O'Brien, Nolan Perro, Dylan Picard, Caden Pickering, Ben Sylvester, Bella Thoreau, Tom Vinay, Finn Walsh, Jamie Walsh, and Christian Zen. Congratulations to our grade eight students. We are so proud of you. And now we have a special message of congratulations for our eighth graders as they transition into high school. Mrs. Follin, thank you for allowing me to add my congratulations to our eighth grade graduates, the class of 2024. You made it. You've done so well and we're so proud of you for all you've accomplished over the last year or two here. And you've grown in so many ways, ways that you don't even know. And now you're ready for the next big step in your educational journey and in your life. And that is the move from eighth grade to ninth grade, moving up. And it's a big step, a real big step. I recall very well, believe it or not, when I was your age, how I felt. I felt filled with concern and anxiety because I didn't know if I could be successful. I was leaving a public school, uh, junior high school in Quincy, and I was going to move to Archie's, a brand new environment. But you don't have any of those issues. You're already here. You've already succeeded. 
You already know our teachers, our faculty, our administration, our coaches. You know the way we do things. So you don't have any of those problems. And you know you can succeed because you've already succeeded here. So I look forward to the next four years. They're going to be very exciting as you continue to grow and to meet your potential as students and as people. I look forward to that and I wish you all the best. And in closing, I want to repeat a request that I've made earlier today. And that is, over the next four years, you are going to be joined by people who will, along with you, will make up the Archie's class of 2024. And I want to ask you to welcome them with open arms. Some of them are coming from schools that have closed, schools they love just the way you love Archie's. Please make them feel at home. Make this their second home the way it is yours. That's all I can ask, and I know you will. So congratulations. Have a great summer, and I look forward to seeing you all in the fall. Congratulations, eighth graders. We are so proud of you as a community. Uh, I gave the seventh, eighth, and eighth grade some extended remarks earlier in this ceremony, but for right now, for just you guys, I want you to know how proud we are of you and that the journey really is just beginning. It gets better. Um, we're going to continue to grow together, to learn together. Um, but take the minute today and be proud of what you have done and get psyched for the fall. Amen? Amen. Congratulations, 8th grade. We're very proud of you. Hey, guys. Just want to say good luck and congratulations to the class of 2024 as they move on to ninth grade. I'm so excited for you guys and see everything that you accomplish at the high school. I'm so proud of everything you've done the past two years at the middle school, and I know you guys are gonna make me so proud. Good luck, and I'm gonna miss ya. Hey, eighth graders, it's Mrs. Malik. I wanted to say congratulations on going on to the high school. Um, it was so nice to meet all of you and work with you this year. I really enjoyed it, and I can't wait to see a lot of you in the high school next year. Have a great summer. Hello, eighth graders. Just want to say congratulations on making it to high school and best of luck in the next four years. Go Bishop. Hello, eighth grade and congratulations. I am so proud of all of you and all the work that you've accomplished in the middle school. Um, and I am so excited to see you come over next year to the main building. Um, always come by for a high five, a Jolly Rancher, some life advice, whatever you guys need. Um, but I'm so proud of you and so excited to see you going up to be freshman next year. Congratulations, eighth grade. I can't believe you're already basically high schoolers. Congratulations, we will see you Hi, eighth grade. I can't believe it's the end of my year with you already. I feel like I missed out on so much time with you this year, but I know that you guys are gonna go on to do great things in high school and I can't wait to see you do them. Good luck next year. You're gonna be so amazing and I'm so proud of all of you. Felicitaciones to my eighth graders. Congratulations. We had a good year. We accomplished a lot. Next year, you will be my shining stars in the high school. Have a nice summer. Stay safe and healthy. Once again, felicitaciones. Hasta el año que viene. Adios. Class of 2024. I'm sure this is not how you ever imagined ending your eighth grade year, but this is one school year you'll remember forever. I'm so glad to have shared our time together in Naz Hall. From days in baby blues, to spirit wear for days of service, to pajama days for the first ever seventh grade to celebrate Catholic Schools Week at Archie's. Each one of you is capable of bringing good into the world, and I can't wait to see you do it. All the best in high school and beyond. Good luck, darlings.